guys, we're back with episode 4 of FTB Mage Quest. And, um, this is actually right after recording the last episode, so if you guys put anything in the comments, I won't be able to read them. But, um, yeah, so I went ahead and made the nightshades, got some nightshades, because why not? It was in the quest book, I just wanted to get it done. And then I picked the nightshade reward, so now I have a full 4x5, uh, setup of nightshades and day blooms and they're all linked to this one and i did not get rid of the hydrangeas uh they're just underneath uh, i guess i'll show you um they're right underneath here you see there's the water but um and then i got i made an endo flame which um it, it gave me the hydrangeas, so I don't know why it asked me to make one. I didn't have to make it. Endo flame, I had to make though. And this is not too hard. It was a uh, brown petal, red petal, gray, light gray petal, and a red mana petal, and a brown mana petal. Which, to make the petals, the mana petals, you take any petal up to here there's a green check mark you drop it in and you get your mana pedal but I'm not gonna do it with this and um, yeah so basically what the endo flame does I can put it like right here and here and say I wanted to get some mana pretty fast I would grab uh, let's just make a coal block for now I would get a coal block you, it's any type of burnable thing. So, cold block, drop it on, wait, and it'll turn red. And if you drop, like, a stack on at a time, it'll only take one item, and the rest would most likely despawn. But, um, you could automate this process pretty well, because there's, like, a mana detector. But you see how fast it's generating mana if you look at this mana spreader, and I keep right clicking, if it wasn't lagging. <laughs> But yeah, it generates really fast. So that's good to get mana. And this is a large storage of mana, the regular mana pool. Not sure about the diluted. I never kept it for a long time. But now we have to make... We could either go to the nether, but I want to continue with Batania. So... Sorry about that. So what am I going to do? I'm going to... Don't think I can get this yet. I think the catalyst requires blaze rods, and I am right. But I can make the horn of the wild, which I like. I really like it. Horn of the wild, um, not hard to get. I know how to get these, so I'm gonna need some shears because to get the pasture seeds, you need uh grass, not like the grass block but um oops the oh my gosh like actual grass i don't know how to explain it tall grass is that it oh wait it's not even night i thought it was night it's uh oh and i also made myself a fence gate this kind of grass and you take this grass and you drop it into the mana pool, which I can do. And then I need five of this. So, Horn of the Wild. And this is a pretty neat tool. Boom. Like everything around me just gone. Uh, we can make a magnet. Which would be easier to pick items up, of course, um, from the Horn of the Wild. And I will most likely do that pretty soon. I'm not sure how to do it. I might need to go to Ring of Magn to the Nether. So I need Mana Steel, which isn't hard. It's iron in a mana pool or a block of iron. Uh, back. Magnetizing. I need just gold and the mana land, so I need nine iron into a mana pool. Which I should not have done that. Oh, what what did I just pick up? 
I saw a book. A book type thing. Just put all these in here. Put them when I can. Raise Zombie 1. Ooh, that sounds really cool. That sounds like a cool and interesting mod. It, it, I think I can, like, raise zombies. So I basically need a block of mana seal. And then I need this. Do I have any sand in here? I do have one piece of sand. Which I need six pieces, actually. How do I only have one piece of sand? I don't know. Which I'm actually gonna... Eh. Okay, let's just... One, two, three, four, five. And... Because eight. Because coal smells eight, all I will get eight pieces. And I've been gathering my sugar cane slowly. Surely, but slowly. Slowly, but surely. Is that how it goes? I don't know. So there we go. And I'll just... I don't know why I have the diluted mana pool on me. I forget. But if it, I had it for a reason, I forgot that reason. And here's some of this, some of this, some dish. And I'm going to put this in here. Okay, so that's still smelting. And, um... So basically, it takes a larger sum of mana, so I can't do it yet, as you see. But this is still running, so it runs for a long time. But this will eventually turn. How much mana does it take? Yeah, see, that... Ten times of mana. And this is only... So it's, I'm gonna have to get it literally like up to that bar, which kind of sucks because that's gonna be a while. I really want that ring of magnetization too. Oh, I got a spawn dire wolf twenty. Uh, is this just a spawn wolf? I'm guessing. What? Uh, nine five. Spawn, how about that? So there's no actual spawn eggs in here, I'm guessing. If I go to creative tabs, no. So there would be the spawn eggs in here. But I'm guessing it just spawns a wolf named Direwolf20 that I could tame. Which I might do. Because why not? It's kind of funny. Uh, I don't have any bones though, so Dire of 20 you can be in there for now, and my actual fences are not here, they're up here, this is where I kept them, uh, oh, this is done, which isn't that useful yet, it was a pain, correct, I hope. So basically I need, I don't know how many I can do yet, but what is the next quest? What was I making? I could go for in the cauldron, okay so diamond, pearl, and glass. Ooh, the pearls I don't have much of at all, but Hmm, if I go find an ender pearl, I could do that quest and I could get 10 more mana steel and then I could get the mana pearls because I have diamonds, which is kind of sad. And I don't have to actually submit it. Ah, so I got seven. And then it says manual detect. So yeah, I detected that already. Um, how is it again? Let's see, it was four around here. 
Oh yeah, I actually shouldn't have done the block anyways because I need this one iron ingot for this right here. And I just need that one more iron. Uh, I'm not sure if I can turn the glass into it yet, but I need 10 glass, so I'm going to have to go get 8 more sand. Which I should probably sleep before I do. So, I don't know what my plans are for this episode. I might take a trip to get obsidian to go to the nether. But I, I don't know, there's no forms of flight. Uh, is that eight? Or is that only like six or something? Seven. I don't have any forms of flight. Oh my gosh, I can't talk. I don't have any form of flight. I could get a globe, or a, not a globe trotter sash, a regular sash. Sash. Oops. Sojourner sash. Oh my. You need runes. Which aren't too hard to get, I hope. Okay, this is pretty hard to get. Not that hard. A rune of air, how about this? Again, not that hard. Just needs mana. I guess. Um... Oh, can I put this in yet? Please let me put it in. Come on. Freaking mana pool. Okay, I'm, I'm, the endo flame is empty. Uh, so I might just be dropping coal into this. Don't have much coal to drop, but I have enough to do at least one more block. And then, hopefully, now I'm getting tons of mana, this will be able, uh, I just want to get my ring of magnetism, come on, come on, we're just patiently waiting here. There we go, we did it. So now I can basically just ring of magnetization. Hold shift for more info. So basically I put it in here and I can go around, I can use this and well, it's a ring of magnetization. It's kind of self-explanatory. Unless you don't know what magnetization is or magnets, but yeah, it basically pulls item towards you. So, it works really well for with the Horn of the Wild, because not only do you clear out the terrain, but you get all the flowers, you get all the seeds, everything. So, and it, I mean, honestly, I like my terrain. Like, it looks really nice, cleared. So I'm just having fun with it now. <laughs> Clear. And if and when you're like holding the ship or crouch, it doesn't magnetize, but when you let go it does. So that's a feature I like. Um so basically just run around collecting all the flowers. And this is I don't know. I like it, and I think it's useful for obsidian too, when you're mining obsidian. I don't know if it'll go into the lava right away, or if it'll go into your inventory first. But this might be useful for obsidian also, because it might just go into your inventory first. But I think I'm, I've cleared out this terrain good enough. I've got enough flowers, right? Yeah, my inventory is full. When your inventory gets full, and you can't accept any more types, I uh, say they'll just follow you to where you're going, which I have nothing following me yet. So I guess that's good. Yeah, see. Oh no, I 
red space. So basically I can just all the flowers, all these mystical flowers. Now I have a bunch of flowers and seeds. All these seeds too, that's that's kind of the annoying part of it. But I mean I need these seeds eventually, right? Do I have this in here? Yes. You go here, you go here. And I think that's it for the Horn of the Wild and the Ring of Magnetization. I just wanted that, so that was a side project. But now I need a mana diamond and a mana glass and a mana pearl. Which I still need to get a pearl. An ender pearl. That's how you get a mana pearl, by the way. In case you guys haven't guessed. Which I got the eight glass and I never smelted it. Why? Because I'm smart. Okay, anyways. My shovel did break. I'll need to make a new one. Oh crap, somebody went up in flames. Call the fire department. Somebody hurry, fast. Okay. And then I can, so I can put my shears in there too. And I'll put my bucket back later. This I can put in there. I bet I can't like sort it though. Um. So I want to do the mana diamond first before the glass, because I'm not sure how much it'll take, and I just want to get this out of the way. Mana glass, I know, doesn't take much. I'm pretty sure, because basically just I don't know. It's like a building material, so I would think that it wouldn't take much. But I guess I can go get some obsidian. How much do I have? One one piece, I think. So I am going to talk to you guys while I mine obsidian. And hope that it all goes swell. So here we are. Um So I'm getting this obsidian. I kinda wanna go to the nether. I wanna get a sojourner's sash also um before i go to the nether so i'm gonna try to get mana for that but i don't know how well that will go because i need tons of mana for it i guess i'm not sure yeah see i don't know if it was because of the water ah you why are you not blocked off Yeah, there we go. So I need six, uh, I don't know, 14 if I want the corners. But I don't know if I want the corners. Doesn't really matter. I just need to get tons of fucking obsidian. Uh, yeah. Um... Do, 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 do. I don't know. So basically, we have to get a mana pearl, um, more glass. We have to make a runic altar. We have to get blaze rods for the equivalent exchange thingamabob. Which, I, I really like that uh, equivalent exchange thing. It's a really cool feature in Batania. Um, I can show you it, I guess. If I go to a mana manipulation, I'm pretty sure. Um, no. Generating functional alpha mency. No, the natural apparatus alchemizing with mana. So if I look at all the recipes, I can go right here. I can turn. Basically, this is a, these are the recipes. And then you know you turn saplings. Glowstone to glowstone. Quartz quartz. Basically just a lot of cool stuff that you can do. Actually, can you get blaze rods from anywhere? I wonder. Well, I mean I need the blaze rods to make it, so. Ooh, I can turn a gas gear into 
two ender pearls, which is kind of good. It's actually really good. Okay. So yeah, it's cool. And we have eight pieces of obsidian right now. And I think we have one at the house, but I'm just going to get a couple more just in case we ever need it. So, I guess I'll get two more. Two or three. Four, maybe. I don't know. I think this is my last piece. I did not mean to place that torch. And there we go. This doesn't spawn any mobs, no. Just in case, though. Cover it up. And... Uh, back out here. Um... Yeah, I mean, I don't know. So I got the obsidian for the portal. I have lint. I really wanted to make my sash before I went. But I just don't think I'll have enough mana. Oh, perfect. A truck. I love trucks. Especially when they ride right by my house. So I had two pieces. So I guess I can make my portal all the way over here. Uh, bring this floor down by one. That won't be too hard. Because the entrance to the portal is, of course, three high. So, um, I mean, I think in this version you can actually customize the size of them. Oh my gosh, I love trucks. Especially when they're, I mean, I don't know if you guys can even hear that, but holy crap, I love it. Actually, I could have done before. But, anyways, it looks good now. I just didn't want the sound near my face. So, how much iron do we actually need, or mana steel do we need for this? For a sash. Okay, so we need one. Oh my. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven. So, would it be an injury to get a block? Oh my, I'm gonna need to go mining. getting that block soon but there we go 10 mana glass and now we just even lower so how much actual of this can we get yeah we got two pieces and I need seven so I guess I'm gonna have to go to the nether before I get that sash <laughs> um yeah there we go, and I guess I'll just bring this stuff with me. I hope I don't die. I don't have much armor, and I only have like two blocks of iron. Achievement get, we need to go deeper. There we go. Yeah. So I hear I can get my mushroom. There's some... Oh my. These structures look dangerous. Like I would never want to go to them. Um... But there's quartz. Quartz is always good, I think. Da da da. I may be doing a lot of mining this episode, but I mean, it's it's basically just waiting. And actually, my base isn't loaded right now, because there's no chunk loaders, right? Yep, no chunk loaders, so I can't actually load my base, which kind of sucks. And by kind of, I mean it really sucks. 
Um, what is that? Ore. Let's see. Is there another ore? Like, like a blue ore? Ah! What? I just died to Marathi. Um, not so happy about that. I really want my stuff back. So what am I gonna do? I said I wasn't, I hoped I wasn't going to die. Never actually really got any armor for it though. Is this your Michael? But you're on fire. Are you, are you like... Oh my gosh. Holy cow, I just want my stuff. And I don't think they're actually near my stuff. But... This is my gravestone. I'm happy that that breaks early. Easily. Oh, you can't put chicken bones as a character in the pack if there's no chicken jumps. I did not mean to attack you, zombie pigman. I thought you were a player. I'm stupid. Okay, I need to make it out of here alive now. No more zombie pigmen. Uh, where's my portal? I might want to make a waypoint for this portal. You think? Uh-huh. Yeah. So if I actually go near you, you won't attack me? That's sweet. You see I'm eating beef instead of, like, pork. And you're a pigman, so... I think that's good. It's good reputation. Here's that stuff again. What is this? Mana crystal source. What the heck is mana crystal? That looks fancy. I like it. Oh my. I just want to find, like... What was it? What was I looking for? Blazes? I want to find another fortress. That's what I want to find. Oh yeah, actually. Uh, death remove. But I really don't want to die again. So what am I going to do? I'm going to take precautions to avoid death beyond the grave. Because I'm, I mean, I'm in hell. So would it be death beyond the grave? Is that even a thing? Because, I mean, technically this is hell. Death beyond earth, maybe? Is, is Minecraft on earth? Is this... I just want to find a nether fortress or something. Ah, fireball. Creator of such a good mod just died. Oh my. Here we go. I just want to get some blue shown. It's okay. But I really, really am going to need some ender pearls, blaze rods. This music is perfect right now if you guys can't actually hear the music it's like very very uh i don't know it's not that actually intense but the the noise it made at the moment that all of these people just appeared from around the corner it was pretty perfect die break 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 a call seki I'm butchering names. Caveman Films? No! You die. You die over there. There's a ghast. Ooh. 
Oh, I thought that was another fortress. Okay. So this is basically exploring the nether with CJ. Um, I don't know. I don't know what those structures are. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to one. I'm gonna go check one out and see if it's good. Ah, you need to die, Rorax. All these people, all these names, I know. Not actually all of them. But what is it? Stuff. Is it a block? going through there no it's a, it is a liquid see look at that I think that's like generic B don't kill me if I'm wrong what is this is this blood oh that's nasty it's flowing blood what the heck why is that a thing Just, just, just ignore me. Um, go. Pigman, you can take care of them. So these are now my new waypoints, by the way. Ah, you can't get to me. Sucker. You're not ranged, which is really good. I mean, if I fall now, I'm pretty sure I'm dead. There we go, there we go, there we go. Da da da. You just, just mind your own business and never come back, please. So close I can taste it. So close to living. I can taste my life. Ah, I'm at a cobblestone. Oh no. That's a wisp. Wisps are bad. Everything else I'm saving except my grave. Go! Into the portal to safety! And I guess that's the end of the episode. Uh, we made a portal. We explored. We looked for blazed rods. Blaze. Oh my gosh, if I can speak, it'd be lovely. We looked for blaze rods. But we found none. So what are we gonna do? I don't know. But I do need that mushroom. I'm going to keep that mushroom on me at all times. <sighs> I'm joking, it's actually going right here. Okay, so... On a forest, everything's good. Don't need this. Okay, so I'm gonna see if I can make any more of this stuff. Might make a runic altar before we go. Actually, how do you make a runic altar? I look in my book. Uh, runic altar. So that's really easy to do. Okay, I'm gonna get a piece of gold and another diamond. Last piece of gold. I have more diamonds than gold, apparently. And that's that. Da da da. Do I have enough to transform it? No. But I do have one on hand. That's why I wanted to do that first, I guess. Did I need this? Six. And I need five of this. And I'll go with the black pedal. So basically, the reason I'm making this is... You should probably tell what I'm making now. But I'm making a mana spreader. I sp nah, I got five of this. Oh crap. 
Can't tell me I got four. I got five. I know I did. And a runic altar. So is that it for that one quest? Yeah. Five mana pearls and five mana diamonds. I am actually amazing. Claim records. Look at this. I can actually make this now. How hard is it to make that rune? Those runes, man. Nah, nah, nah. I'm I'm making the sash first. Rune of air. I need string, feather, and carpet. I'm making it. Might want to explain this first. String, feather. One, two, three. Oh, it's only two. Okay. Uh, I just need one of these. How much for the other one? Green of Earth. I need stone, block of coal, and a mushroom. Do I have any stone? I do not, but I can get stone. Boom. Boom. And then a block of coal. Which is gonna put me down in the gutter for coal and a mushroom. Before we actually wrap up the episode, I just want to make this. Because now I have the mana steel for it. Okay, so basically what you do is you need a runic altar. Place wherever you want. Um, I'm gonna place my mana spreader here. And then I'm gonna go into bind mode. Shift right click, shift right click. That's how you bind stuff, by the way. I didn't actually say that earlier. So you need, what is this? Okay, so what is it for, wrong thing. Book. So I need one, two, three. Stone, coal block, mushroom, right click with the wand of the forest. And there's a little timer bar. I don't know if you can see it that well, but it's right there. And that tells you how much time you have left. And um, it doesn't take that much mana. So that's why I can do this. And then back, I need Rune of Air. And then when there's lightning effects, it'll. that's when it's done. And you need to drop a living rock on it. And then right click with the wand. Is it done? Let's see. Almost done. I'll get my leather. I'm happy I found cows. I mean, I needed to find cows. And I'm sorry that my voice may have been back. It felt like I was farther away from my microphone. Because I was. I was leaning back in my chair. What? Are we really out of mana? No. You can't tell me this now. I don't care, I'm using all my coal. Actually, no. I'm gonna put this back, and then I'm gonna split coal among the two. One here, one there, I get double the production. And then when they run out, they'll have extras. Which, coal doesn't last for that long, I'm pretty sure. Come on, it's almost done. And then I need to make one more rune after this, which kind of sucks. Come on. Are you done? That's lightning effects. Oh no. Drop. Boom. Three runes. So now I need one, two, three. One, two, three, and go. Moon of air. I need to get this process done. This is going to be a long episode. I really just want to finish dish. I mean, I'm good on generation right now. I'm good at keeping up at least. Oh no. 
hide mode. Boom, you right to there. Skip the in between. Come on, it's almost done. And then I just need. I really want this sash because I want to show you guys what I can do or what it does. You are not allowed to take my stuff, algorithm. You take, have your own stuff. Yeah, have your own stuff, algorithm. Oh, come on. Faster. Yep, it's done. Boom. Okay, and now... I really want this sash, as you guys can tell. And... Man of Steel. Boom! Sojourner's sash, it's another bobble. Put it on. Where'd my ring go? Anyways, I can jump and walk really fast. I don't know where my ring went, but I'll find it. Probably in one of my chest downstairs. Yeah, so I will... I'm, I'm happy that I have this now. That's good. See? Jump. Run. So I can just... I think I jumped two blocks high. So that's it for this episode. Um, yeah, basically. Oh, no. Stop generating mana. And wasting. So, oh, it also gives uphill step assist. So I can walk on blocks and not care about it so now I can just put this stuff in here I can spare my diamonds and that's been a good episode we made good progress we got myself a sash which wasn't a quest right no but oh my gosh this is crazy I need the elements so I can get those next episode, which I'm not recording today, so I'll be able to look at your comments, and um, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Alright, see ya.